Natatakot ka ba mag red lipstick? Pues, now's the time for you to try it. For today's Rikified, I will teach you how to do an easy everyday red lipstick look like this. I promise na super dali lang tong look na to. Masusundan nyo siya, promise. Huwag na natin patagalin pa. Let's go and put that red lipstick on! Hello gorgeous! It's me, Rick. Welcome back to my channel. First things first, skincare. Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair Serum. Promise gagawin ko tong super easy and very doable. Next moisturizer, Revitalizing Supreme from Estee Lauder also. Because I need extra moisture. Because I'm super dry right now. Next eye cream also from Estee Lauder, their ANR Eye Complex. Madaming girls natakot magsuot ng red lipstick. I don't know why. Siguro kung ako babae, isa siya sa magiging everyday look ko. Red lipstick. Kasi there's something about red lipstick na nakaka-feminine. Lambot-lambot mo lang, babae ka lang. At the same time, strong. Diba? Huya! Strong, independent, soft girl. At dahil ang emphasis ng look na to ay yung lips natin, of course, we also need to prep our lips. I will use this lip repair potion from Estee Lauder. I super like this. Parang after a few minutes mga feel mo parang super moisturized, super plump ng lips mo. And we're done with our skincare. Let's do primer. I will use my favorite primer from Guerlain. Kagamit ako ng dalawang primer ngayon. Isang pang pore minimizing, tsaka isang regular. Ito yung regular lang. Then for my T-zone, kung saan malaki ang aking pores, I will use this one from Milk Makeup. Okay, apply ko siya kung saan ako. Hayahay sa pores. Then I will correct my under eyes and other dark areas with my Radiant Creamy Concealer in Shade Hun. May napanood akong technique nito. Ibabad mo daw muna siya ng very light. So we will try that today. Bago mo siya i-blend. Okay, so mag-Instagram muna. A few moments later. Okay, pwede na siya. I'll just blend it out with my fingers. So I'm using it as a corrector, hindi as a concealer. Next foundation we will use, Laura Mercier's Flawless Lumiere Radiance Perfecting Foundation. I will mix two shades, 2W1 and 3W1. I will use my free Sephora VIB Rouge Rogue. Whatever. Basta siya yung libre. Kapag na-reach mo yung certain amount ng points. For me, important yung base. Kapag nag-red lipstick ka, parang dapat lahat. Di naman malinis na malinis na perfect. Pero dapat, dapat maganda. <laughs> parang hindi compatible yung milk primer sa foundation na to. Nag-slide yung nasa ilong ko. Okay, now I know. Then with my beauty sponge, I will blend lang. Next, let's do concealer. I will use Estee Lauder's Double Wear Radiant Concealer. I will mix two shades because I don't have the exact shade that I need. I will mix 3W and 2N. Then I will blend using my sponge kanina. Kumusta naman kayo sa mga bahay-bahay nyo, guys? Ano pinagkakabisihan nyo? Kung ano, go work out. Maka Four to five times a week. Dahil ang dami nating time. Let's set our face. I will use different powder for my under eye. This is my favorite, personal favorite for setting my under eyes. This is from Laura Mercier. Secret Blurring Powder for under eyes. It's really made for under eyes. Para ma-flatten yung curve chart. Para ma-flatten yung bump. So, of course, don't forget to remove the crease kung may creasing before setting it. I also use it here. And for the rest of the face, I will use this one from Hourglass. It's the Veil Translucent Setting Powder. I will powder my T-zone lang. Kasi I want the dewiness of the foundation to stay sa dito, sa, dito sa outer part. So, powder pa lang yun sa T-zone. Okay, isang mabilisang eye makeup. We will use this one from Tom Ford. Cream eyeshadow siya na may kasama na ding powder. It's in shade Naked Bronze. So, meron siyang bronze cream. Tapos may kasama siyang highlight powder. So, I'll teach you how I use it pag madalian. 
So first, let's get the cream. Use any synthetic brush like this. And just use it all over. Ilagay nyo muna siya sa immediate lid nyo. Tapos, bend nyo lang. Following the natural contours of your eye. Okay, let's also do the bottom. Kunti lang. Yan, o diba? Isang product lang. Tapos, gagamitin natin yung powder na kasama para lang sa gitna. I'll just use my finger. Then, I'm gonna put it in the middle. Yan, nagdag effect lang. Then, I will do my liner using this liquid real lasting eyeliner from K Palette. Then, I will curl my lashes. What's your favorite curl lash? Ako, I only use this one for myself, ha? Shiseido, kasi perfect siya sa eye shape ko. Then, let's apply mascara. Terry Blee from By Terry. Then, I will use this Deviant Eye Pencil in the shade Doyen for my lower eye rim. To so open up my eyes. A little bit more for more chances of winning. Say what? Then I will do a quick brow using the Sunny Space Light Brow in shade Ash Brown. I will just do a Calma Brow. Nothing special. Just a regular brow day. Dahil feeling ko, isi-save naman ako ng red lips ko. Ganun. Then I will use this Laura Mercier Brow Dimension in shade Brunette for more power ng brows. Huya! Let's go back to the face for today. Sabi ko nga dahil mabilisan tayo, I will not use a contour. But I will use a bronzer for contour. Pwede naman na yun kung gusto nyo ng kalma lang na shading. I will use my Laguna bronzer from NARS. So kung everyday lang naman, pwede ka nang mag-bronzer lang. Kung wala kang time mag-contour, pwede na din siya. May konting sculpting na din siya na magagawa. Okay, then next is blush on. This is a very important part. Fart! What the hell? This is a key step when you're wearing red lipstick. Always wear a blush on. So these are my favorite blush ons for red lipstick. Use something na medyo reddish, pinkish tone. For me, that's the perfect shade for blush if you're wearing red lipstick. So first, this one from Becca, this palette. I super love these two shades, mixing these two shades when I do red. And then this one also from Hourglass, perfect tong dalawang to. And of course, my NARS Sirang Orgasm. But for today, we will use this one from Hourglass. So I will just mix these two shades. And I will just put it on the top apples. So I just smile like that. A baby smile, then follow it. Of course, don't forget your highlight. I will use this one from Ilamasca. It's their Beyond Powder in shade OMG. Perfect siya for Pinoy skin. It has a parang golden something-ish shade. And a little bit on the bridge of my nose. On the tip. And here. And konti na rin sa lips. And konti na din sa chin. Para mas elongated. Okay, it's time for the lips. But before I do that, I will share to you my favorite go-to red lipsticks. This first two, ito yung mga kahit anong kulay mo. Pwede siya. This one from Lisa Eldridge, it's Velvet Ribbon. And this one, So Marilyn from Charlotte Tilbury. Yan. Basic reds. Okay, next, ito perfect siya sa mga mapuputi. This one also good for, for baguettes. This is Retro Matte in Relentlessly Red from MAC. And this one from Tita Pat McGrath, Obsessed 211. And this one is from Laura Mercier in the shade Rouge Electric. You have light skin, perfect. Though. And this one for Morena naman. Both from Laura Mercier in shade Rose, Rouge, and Rouge Muse. And I'm contemplating pa nga eh. Alin ba? What do you think? 
I think I'm gonna go with the Lisa Eldridge. But first, of course, I'm gonna do liner. Safest thing to do when doing reds, mag-liner muna kayo para hindi mag-bleed yung lipstick. So I'll be using this Makeup Forever lip pencil in shade 8C. I'll just follow the natural shape of my lips. Tsaka pag nagli-lip pencil muna kayo under, mas matagal siya. Then, papasadahan ko lang yung loob ng isang manipis na layer for the longevity. Then, the lipstick na. You can use naman directly from the tube, but for others, it's easier to use lip brush. So, I will try it directly from the tube. Napansin ko kasi kapag direct from the tube, mas powerful yung pagka-red niya. Ang ganda ko! <laughs> Then I'll give you a tip if you really want your red lipstick to last longer. So just get any facial tissue, tapos blood lang. Yan. And then put another layer. Then after doing your lips, do another check. If you need more color pa. Kasi minsan masyadong powerful yung nagagawa mong red lipstick. So no wash out the rest of the face. So check lang. I think I can add more blush. There, I think this is better. And of course, we need to set our face. I'm using this Glam Glow Glow Setter again. Here you go! My easy everyday red lipstick makeup look. Super easy, diba? So I challenge you, if you haven't tried wearing red lipstick yet, now's the time dahil walang makakakita sa'yo. <laughs> so now I challenge you to wear a red lipstick. I promise you won't regret it. So just follow this super easy red lipstick tutorial and I'm sure, kayang kaya nyo yan. Thank you for watching guys and please hit the like button if you learned something from today's tutorial. And please, don't forget to subscribe and watch my last video. Thank you for watching and please pay in naman ng video suggestions. Just put it on the comment down below.